welcome inside the Lightroom Classic window and this is the photo that we are going to work on today. And my goal in this editing will be removing this wonderful people on the background, which of course you can try to remove with Lightroom Classic and let's try it right now. So I will zoom the area, we'll open the retouching section and choose a razor and just start to paint over the people. And this is the results we got. Perhaps if you will zoom out, it will be not that visible, but we are here about best results. So let's remove. And let's make it in a bit more advanced way. I recommend you to apply preset on your photo before you want to remove any objects or subjects on your photo. I will just use fast preset that I have. So after you applied preset on your photo, we need to export photo inside the Photoshop, but for this you don't need to export photo from the Lightroom Classic, you just need to click with right mouse button on the photo and choose edit in, edit in Photoshop. I recommend you to choose edit a copy with Lightroom adjustments and just click edit. And Photoshop will be launched automatically on your computer and the photo will be automatically open in the new window. Now we have our photo in Photoshop and to remove any objects or subjects from the background, of course, I recommend you to use super new and popular generative field from Photoshop. For this, just zoom the area you would like to manipulate, choose rectangular marquee tool, select the area you would like to adjust, hold shift on your keyboard to add a new areas into the selection, and let's click with right mouse button and choose generative field. Leave the field empty so generative field could analyze background around the selected area and just recreate it and click generate. Now when this process is done perfectly, we can compare these results with the Lightroom Classic and Photoshop Generative Fill. Also, if for example you would like to make any other adjustments on the photo, please feel free and expand your photo, change something on the background, whatever you feel comfortable with. But when you will finish your adjustments in Photoshop, we need to save this version, so it will appear inside the Lightroom Classic just right near the original photo. Let's click Ctrl S or you also can click File and Save. When saving process is finished, just open your Lightroom Classic and you already can see our photo after changes with manipulation we did. And if you will open all your photos, you will see the original photo and right near this photo, our new photo that we just edit in Photoshop. So with just simple editing trick, you can easily work on editing your photos between two softwares without any problems and with most comfort for your work.